police are beefing up their capabilities to combat crime at the upcoming casinos. Over the next two days, a joint training symposium organized by the Casino Regulatory Authority and the Criminal Investigation Department will train officers in casino operations, regulations and enforcement. Speaking at the opening of the event, Minister for Law and Second Minister for Home Affairs K. Shanmugan said preventive measures are in place to fight against crime. The IRs are potential targets not just for criminals but also for terrorists. Our robust frameworks and varied experiences must translate to safety, security, law and order on the ground. To achieve this, frontline forces and domain owners need to be attuned to the operating environment in and around the IRs as a whole. In fact, anti-fraud measures are already installed in the gaming machines. These are the new electronic table game machines that will be used at the upcoming casino. It eliminates the use of actual playing cards, chips and a dealer. It's all touchscreen and all you have to do is to insert your bills at the side of the table and you're ready to play. For other table games, an electronic card shuffler will be used. This device shuffles the cards while the dealer distributes them to the players. This decreases the risk of cheating during the game. To maintain law and order in the casinos, the CID will be setting up a casino investigation branch, which will have satellite offices located within the casino premises to detect and respond swiftly to crimes.